Hey you guys, what's up? I am Danielle. Welcome to today's vlog. It's actually going to be a weekly vlog, which I have only done once. I always do daily vlogs. So I'm going to bring you guys along for our full week this time because my kids are on spring break and we're not going anywhere, but I want to just bring you guys along for the full week and see if I like this better. It is Sunday, you it is Sunday and it is 4:30 you guys. So we're starting this vlog off super late but we're gonna just roll with it the time change just really like kicked me in the butt today but we got this we're gonna keep vibing and going with the flow so we are headed out me and my bigs my six-year-old and eight-year-old if you're new here my 14 actually she's 15 months now my 15 month old is staying at home with dad she's taking a nap so we're gonna head out and go to target lily and jace asked to go to target and i literally don't need anything lily wants to go look around to see what she can see she has her ninth birthday coming up, you guys. I have a nine-year-old. Crazy. She's going to be nine, so she wants to look around for what she's thinking she might want. Her birthday's not until April 25th, you guys, so we're ahead of the game. But we're going to go. I'm going to take her anyways. And I need to pick up a few things for dinner tonight. We're having cheeseburgers, so I'm going to pick up a few things while we're there at Target. And then we're going to come home and just, you know make dinner and get ready for the week so let's go okay so before we go you guys i'm gonna add one of these alani sticks to my cup of water i started buying these a few weeks ago and they're great for like a mid they're they're great for like a midday pickup i'm a caffeine addict as you guys know i drink monster and celsius and coffee and this these little things are like i think 70 milligrams of caffeine so it's not a lot so it's like to drink it like in the middle of the day if i just want to pick me up or i haven't had an energy drink and i just had coffee which is what i had today and sometimes i'm not gonna lie i add two because 70 grams what is that but i do like these they're only ten dollars and you get 10 so i think it's a good deal and like i said i just always want like caffeine so Girl, he hungry. It's just a whole world that's called world. All right, let's get out, litter bugs. <laughs> Do you sleep litter with me? Bugs. I need a purse, you guys, because I'm always carrying the diaper bag, even when I don't have Soraya. I need a cute little purse. <laughs> Why are you with that face? All right, come on. No. My target here does not have the cup holders. What do you do if you get Starbucks? Yeah, there's a Starbucks right there. Yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't see much in the bullseye section, but they do have these cute little dollar storage baskets. And these ones are five with the wicker or cloth around the top. And I like these. I kind of want to get some new jars for like sugar and flour to go on the shelf in my kitchen. These are only $5, so that's a really good deal. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, guys, look at these squirts. I need these. I'm not getting them today, but I need them <laughs> in my life. This is extra small, so it's super tiny. But I plan to wear stuff like this all summer. They have black, purple, blue, bit green, and they have matching little like tank top shirts. I don't think I'm gonna get those because my belly is a no-go. It can't be hanging out, hanging out. But the squirt though, this for $15 is a dream. I love it. I'm getting these. I'm getting these for sure. <laughs> so far, Lily found this little purse she likes. It is adorable. It's like a pale pink. Um, she likes the black purse. Like this the pale yellow. Yeah, that's pretty. I you look so cute. I jumped so I could see myself when I saw. You got them. You guys, I think Jace might be getting glasses. Jace, hold, show everybody your face. A new scar on Jace. Always something. Yeah. But Jace is going to get his eyes tested tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to the doctor, you guys, to like his pediatrician for his well child visit. And I'm going to have her like really check his eyes good. He's been checked at his old school. He's been checked at his new school. And um, his pe pediatrician last year checked him and he had good vision. I was told he has 20, 20 in one eye, 20, 30, I think, in the other eye. I talked to the school nurse l last week because Jace is always complaining about not being able to see the board. And I don't know if he just is too far back or he needs glasses. So we're gonna get that checked out. All the men in my family, like Derek wears glasses, my dad wears glasses, my brother wears glasses, but they didn't have them this young at this age. So I always had 20-20, but since I've had kids, my eyesight has slowly gotten worse with each child. So I probably need to get my eyes checked, but I don't need glasses, but I think my son might need glasses. I don't know. Or he just doesn't want to see the board. I don't know. 
I'm gonna try this because I love a good ranch. So this has to be good, I hope. I think we're gonna get this for seasoning. I'm out of onion powders. So we're gonna grab this one. Again, my lip. Best. With these, we're getting these. These are so good. Mm -hmm. I like tater Which tots. ones? You don't like tater tots? Golden tater tots? Or yeah, golden. Okay. What are tater tots? These are tater tots. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, will have a, a pickup order under the name Derek. Derek, yes. yes. The venti milk cookie crap and the croissant, the pumpkin loaves, and the cake pops? Yes, that's correct. All right, push forward for two of them. You got that. Okay, thank you. Thank you. You too. Okay, Dave, you want your cake pop yeah. now? Yeah. There you go. Lily, you want yours now? Yeah. There you go. Surprisingly, guys, I didn't want any coffee. I just had him get me a chocolate croissant. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you wanted it. Yes. <laughs> I'll just eat my cake pop. It's your cake pop, girl. Derek got a, what do you get? White chocolate, a white chocolate cookie frap or a white mocha cookie frap and pump, two pumpkin bread loaves. And now we're gonna head home and make dinner. Say hot. Say hot. the one to write up a song for just anyone I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations oh cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting but then you came along and proved me all wrong I was so mistaken cause you glue all the pieces back together yeah you you take all my wrongs and make them better yeah you you're making me wanna try forever I feel so free Oh my sweet baby Jason's doctor's appointment Normally Jace and Lily always get seen together But this office they don't see siblings Same day Which is crazy I will always I do wish they would say, I did these faces. Alish. I made this appointment first on purpose because, oh uh, my God. Oh my God. All right, we're back home, guys. I was trying to talk to you guys in the office, but it was just too chaotic. I understand why the doctor will only see one kid at a time because it was just too much. Typically, when I take Jason and Lily together, it is a little crazy, but with three kids, it's insane. I do wish, however, the doctor would see them at the same time, like the two big kids at the same time. It would make my life so much easier, but I get it. So I scheduled, Saray already had her appointment like a week and a half ago, two weeks ago, something like that. Um, Jace, I scheduled his next because he's been um, complaining at school for like the last couple of months about how he cannot see the board. At first, I didn't know if it was just like him not being serious because he passed his eye test at his last well child visit. He passed his eye test at kindergarten that he took at the school. And then he also passed the one he took here um, in Indiana. They had the, you know how the schools have people come out, I mean, Texas. They, you know how the schools have people come out and like test their eyesight. So he passed in both Indiana and Texas. So, um, however, his teacher finally sent him to the nurse's office last week because he was, he's always complaining about not being able to see the board. And she said, and she also said that he can't see it when he sits closer when he's on the carpet. So I'd already had his appointment scheduled. I went to see what the pediatrician said before I um, scheduled him to go see an eye doctor. And his nurse did say he had 20-20 in one eye and 20-30 in another eye. 
the nurse at the school. However, the doctor today, the nurse, well, the nurse confirmed that he has 20, 40 in both eyes and together he has 20, 30. So um, he, we're going to make him an appointment to see a optometrist or whatever. So we can see if he needs glasses. Well, I'm sure he needs glasses. So see if he needs this for school or whatever, but he needs glasses. So I do notice he squints now a lot when like I'm showing him something from across the room or if he's sitting at the table and like looking at TV, he kind of looks at it like this. So my little boy is going to need glasses. So I got to get started on that, I guess. You know, it's funny because like my dad, all the guys in my family pretty much wear glasses. Derek wears glasses. Um, I've always had 2020, but Jason's gonna be getting him some glasses. So, Soraya's asleep right now. I have work to do. Luckily, I have no meetings today. I have to catch up on a lot because um, I've been gone for about an hour and a half, almost two hours really. But I'm gonna go ahead and get started on lunch. I'm gonna make a quick little um, pasta salad for the kids, and I think I'm gonna make myself a burger. Like in a bowl from last night i'm just gonna eat it with no bun and you know put all the toppings in the bowl and eat it that way because i'm hungry now but yeah i just wanted to check in with you guys really quick while i get back before i get back to work and let you guys know how his appointment went so yeah kids lunch is done they're having just a simple pasta with um cucumbers tomatoes and red pepper with italian dressing and then I might make them some garlic toast if we have some. If not, I'll just make um, some regular toast. I'm craving something sweet, you guys. I always want something sweet after I eat something healthy, which is stupid. I know. I have my little bunless burger, and now I'm going to eat cookies. I'm about to make some cookies because I want something sweet. I just need to have self-control. So I'm going to eat two. And I'll make about half of this pack. So they can have something sweet to eat, too. I always give away too much. It's like I've got no sense of touch I'm always pouring out my heart No little by little here I'm always pushing things too far Two, five, six, ten drinks at the bar no boundaries, I get too close No little by little here Cause I give my oh I see you oh, No little by little So I'm about to make sensory bins for my kids Soraya is sleeping She'll be up from her nap soon It's almost 2 o'clock So she's been asleep for quite a while So I want to get this done before she wakes up And kind of disrupts the process but um lily and jason are on spring break i think i told you guys that earlier in this vlog so i was telling lily how i wanted to make sensory bins for soraya while i'm working to keep her distracted and so she can learn and play and so she wanted me to make her and jace one too so we're just looking up like ideas for big kids and i really don't have time to go out of the house to get stuff for the sensory bin so soraya's this time is going to be water based i'm just going to do a Small layer of water with some toys she can play with. She's obsessed with the water. She always wants to get in the sink to play. Like the kitchen sink, the sink in the bathroom, the toilet, the tub, anywhere there's water, she's obsessed. So I'm going to put her on the floor with her tub and just put some water in there and a few toys she can play with. And I think she'll love that. And then for Lily and Jace, I'm going to do, I think, some pasta They'll be able to add toys in there to play with. And we're going to do cream of wheat. And I'm only doing cream of wheat because um, Soraya dumped the box of cream of wheat out on the floor. So we were playing, like picking it up and they were seeing how like satisfying it is to play with. It's kind of like similar to sand. So I'm going to add that to their bin. I did see that um, on Pinterest that some parents will grind up cereal in a blender to make edible sand for toddlers. And I'm going to do that for Soraya, not today, but soon, because she is in the stage where she puts everything in her mouth. Nothing is off limits to her when it comes to putting it in her mouth. So I think the edible sand will be perfect for her. She'll love that. But today it's just going to be water and then the big kids will do um, just different things that they find within 
the house, mainly the kitchen, and then probably put a few toys in there. So let's go ahead and make that. So guys, I'm just gonna use these basic bins here. These used to hold Christmas decorations, but I was able to consolidate it so that I can have two empty bins. And I'm just gonna keep these in the garage so that they don't end up all over the house and like stuff everywhere. So I'm gonna get Lily and Jace's bin together now and Soraya, I'll put the water in hers once she gets up. Here's Soraya now. You're awake? Did you get a good nap? Did you get a good nap? You slept for a long time. We're about to have some fun. Hi, little lady. Hi. And there's just a very little water. Come on, you want to get in? No, she wants to get in. I don't want her to get in there. Mm -hmm. She didn't got all the way into it now, guys. And she keeps trying to drink the water. Bassy inside. Mm. This is special surprise. Bye bye. All right, guys, look at these juicy curls. I just detangled Lily's hair. It took me a good hour because I've been letting her like rock a bun for like way too long. So her hair is detangled. I'm gonna do her a quick little hairstyle so we can go out and run some errands today. I do need to wash her hair. I don't know if I'm gonna wash it Sunday or tomorrow, but um, yeah, this is what we're working with. I'm gonna do a cute little I think two ponytail bubble hairstyle. Bubble, bubble ponytail, is that what they're called? All right, I am going to wake up Jace because Jace has been asleep since he went to get his haircut this morning. They don't need to know that. Uh, Jace has been asleep for an hour, so I'm going to wake him up and change my clothes. Look at my cute little green leprechaun. She's such a little leprechaun. You guys, look at my cute little green leprechaun. Oh, your glasses are upside down. Now get my glasses. I didn't realize St. Patty's Day is in two days, so she might wear this outfit again. No judging the baby. You ready to go? Yeah. Another day, another store. There we go. I don't know. One thing about me, I keep it extra fast because it always falls as soon as we get in the store. Yeah. I am learning to always have the kids a jacket in the car because it'll be like 80 degrees and sunny in Texas. And we're going to get 25. Just take off the whole thing like that. Yep. Sit down. Mm. What's that, Soraya? Apple. What is it? What's that? Apple. apple. She calls all red fruits apples. No. Go ahead, sorry. sorry. You're okay. No. Adorables. Okay. No. Can you please sit down? No. Have a seat. No. Lily's low key looking at toys. Um, okay, hold on. I'm trying to find these vases. I don't know where they're at, but guys, it will be 80, 80 degrees in Texas, and then you go outside two minutes later, and it's um windy and like it feels like 55 or something. So I know now to keep a jacket in the car for the kids at all times because it was literally just hot, and now it's like really windy and cloudy. The sun is not shining at all. It is supposed to storm tonight, but not so much later. It's not that I don't want you here. Yeah. It's not about the way you set my eyes. I know Guys, Walmart has slim jeans. The only slim they have are 
these black ones this medium wash which i don't really care for medium wash too much i prefer light or dark so i think we're gonna try these sevens hopefully they fit i've never bought walmart jeans before so i don't know how they're gonna fit but we're gonna try them for 15 dollars Okay guys, here is a overview of what we got from the grocery store. Nothing fancy, regular, regular stuff. I did get some more of these pot stickers. Like I said, I love them. So these um, wontons, these Korean wontons are so good. If you have not tried them, you definitely should. I do like the um, pork ones and the chicken. So we're gonna have that with chicken fried rice. So I got a fried rice seasoning. I also got sesame oil. This makes a big difference for your fried rice. So you should definitely try it if you have not and you like to make fried rice. I did get, um, I'm not going to show you guys everything because I got to hurry up and get the frozen stuff put away. But I'll go over what I'm making for dinner for the week. I did get um, cilantro rice because we're going to have quesadillas, chicken quesadillas one day. And so we're going to have cilantro rice on the side. I got tater tots. The kids have been eating these like crazy. Um, what else did I get? It's different. I know Derek and Lily love to eat, so I got some more of those. Got chicken nuggets for Jace's lunch. I haven't bought dinosaur nuggets in a while. I've been buying just these because it's a little cheaper, and I will save every dollar I can. I did get salmon because we're going to have salmon one night this week. I got chicken for just any easy meal where I can just bake, bake chicken or use chicken in something. So uh, I usually always get this when I go shopping. I have breakfast one night this dinner, so I got biscuits for that. We needed more oatmeal more uh, pancakes and i got some lucky charms which the kids love but i'm also going to make them a little treat for um st patrick's day and then i did get a few cleaning items i got a scrub daddy we needed a new one i got comment for the tubs i saw these on tiktok so i wanted to try these these are scrubbing bubbles um like a toilet fresher you st i don't know what it is to be honest like how to explain it but I'll show you guys when I um, use it, but you like stamp it on the toilet to freshen it up. Um, yeah, and then I got this soap. I don't think I've ever tried this gain soap, so wanted to give it a try to see if I like it. It does say blueberry, and I did not realize that. Oh no, it's not blueberry, thank God. It's honeyberry, it looks like a blueberry. I hate the smell of blueberries. I absolutely hate the taste of blueberries. So I pray that it does not smell like blueberries. It looks like blueberries, but it doesn't say it's a blueberry, so. Hey guys, it is the next morning, which is why my head looks like bad hair. It looks looking crazy. Um, we're getting ready to go to um, the kids' birthday party that Jason was invited to. So I'm about to get the kids dressed. Lily just got the shower. I need to get Jason the shower and get him ready. So he's sleeping, thank goodness. Um, my mom is going to meet us out there, so that's going to be fun. That's the news for you. <laughs> but um, I want to show you guys really quick what the kids got from Walmart yesterday because Lily, I think, is going to wear one of her outfits, at least the top part. So, um, yeah, I ended up picking up just a few things. She picked out, or I picked out this outfit, and she really liked it. I thought this was a cute, like, oversized tee. You know, the girls are wearing the oversized sh shirts right now with um, biker shorts. So, it came with matching biker shorts. And I thought it was a cute pattern, cute colors. For the spring and summertime so she it is like going to be i think 68 today but it's like cloudy and it's going to rain all day so she's not wearing these shorts but she's going to wear the top to um the place and then she also picked out this little cute little ribbed outfit i don't know if you can see the ribs can you see the ribs yeah it's like ribbed and then it's tie-dye, of course, little unicorn. I love the sleeves on it. And it came with her. It also had matching shorts she got as well. And I love the little shorts like this. So Soraya got some like this from Walmart too. Actually, the one she was wearing yesterday, they're from Walmart. And they have the little ruffles on the bottom of the shorts. So super cute. And then Jace, I just picked him up with some cotton shorts because I thought these looked 
cute and comfy. I love this color on him, this baby blue color. So I got him these. And then I was showing you guys, I think, this shirt in the store. This is the back of the shirt. It says um, break boards, not hearts. Now this is not a skater, but I do like the skater boy vibes and preppy boys vibes on him. So I like to get him skater <laughs> looking like Kate skater inspired clothes, even though he is not a skater. So I thought this was super cute. He might wear this today. I don't know what he wants to wear. And then um, I got him these jeans because like you guys know, he needs a slim. The jeans I got him from Old Navy, they were not a slim and they did not fit at all. So I wanted to see how these fit. I've never bought them jeans from um, Walmart, so I don't really know how they're going to hold up. I really wish they didn't have these ribs in them because Jace is really rough on his clothes. And so... Um, any jeans that do already have some hand destruction, like by the end of the month, maybe not the end of the month, but like in six months, the, this is going to be ripped all the way open. His knee and his leg is going to be hanging out. So <laughs> hopefully that doesn't happen because it's just a little bit of destruction, but they, all of the slim jeans they had were, um, you know, had this on it. So that's what he got. I did pick up some of these cute little shoes. I really wish they had some plain white shoes with nothing on them, but they didn't have any like in her size. They only had like seven and up that were plain and simple, but I needed something simple because she doesn't really like wearing shoes. And I was hoping that she can just get some little slide on shoes and she might, you know, do better with those. So we're gonna see how these work. And I think I'm gonna get her some Crocs and we're gonna see if they get her through or get her used to wearing shoes and see if she likes these any better. We'll see. But, um, yeah, like sneakers, she ties that, like we tie up or sandals. She doesn't want to wear them. She just, she just doesn't want anything on her feet anyways, not even socks. So she might not, she probably won't like these either, but we're going to give them a try. I thought they were cute, but I wish Walmart had some simple options. They might've just been sold out at my store, but, um, not could have just been too late. But anyways, she is a size four, but I figure if I get a size five and they fit, a little looser that might be better for her because she does have fat feet so because her feet are wide um i feel like she doesn't like that how tight they are on her feet um but a five i think will give her a little bit more room even if it is a little big at the toe area i'm cool with that so got her those and we're going to go ahead and get ready for this party so we're not late and hopefully we can take our time on the way there in case it's raining so i'll see you guys there <laughs> Toes. <laughs> 